now uh, so we have talked about opaque we kind of have talked about the major consumers the major producers now now uh, you must be familiar with the images of uh, rocking jackie or uh, the thing that looks like a giraffe okay we that is a oil rig pumps basically now realize that currently we are having a decrease in the number of oil rigs that are basically built okay however uh, the decreasing rig count is not completely a factor that is telling us okay maybe the oil uh, is basically getting reduced or something like that so it is completely dependent on the countries to work on how much they should be extracting from a particular rig rig okay so for example in usa so as i mentioned the us shell oil has been so far a game changer and uh, recently we have the number of rigs new rigs that is being constructed decreasing however we have not seen that uh, with the decreasing rig counts we haven't not seen that the production has go, go, gone down drastically it is due to the fact that even when they are decreasing the rig count maybe they are increasing the extraction rates at the existing rigs okay now uh, every month opec basically releases the rig count okay now if you are somebody who is very much keen into the fundamental side i highly suggest you have a look at the global rig count also and uh, on investing.com you can track a lot of updates related to the same so for example the baker hughes rig count okay so that you get on uh, investing.com itself if you go to that economic calendar or you get, go to see the news updates over there you would be able to see all these factors now uh i personally when i was actually working for a european proprietary trading firm earlier so at that particular place at that particular institution uh, we were about 52 traders at the trading desk it was a proprietary trading firm and we were trading in the international markets and uh, we were focusing purely on brent oil the energy team was purely focusing on brent crude okay uh i just want you to understand that the market never sleeps why because it is kind of open for almost 22 hours a day a uh, crude is being traded okay so that dynamic and that continues the market when it comes to crude 22 hours it is continuously being traded just two hours it is closing just think about that our market 9 am 9:15 am to 3:30 pm then it goes to sleep but this international market from uh early morning onwards the late night 2 am it is being traded so 4 am to 2 am it is being traded so just think about that 22 hours the uh, markets are on so that's how dynamic uh, crude oil is 